the moment we've just got the force being applied right at the beginning. What amazing thing might happen if we, instead of just applying the force at the start, we applied the force continually? So actually on update, instead of start, uh, I reckon it would go absolutely berserk because every single frame, so 60 times a second, this would be happening. So you'd have a force and then a sixtieth of a second later, the force could be completely different. Uh, you know, so, well, let's see what happens. I, I think it will be nuts, but let's, let's, uh, let's see what goes on. So we'll just compile that and then bang, this could be crazy. Oh, look at that. Look at that. It's just going nuts. It's flying around. <laughs> oh, but it's all being constrained by the box. I love it. That's that's really amazing. You know what? Let's 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 take it down so that instead of 10, let's just make it one. Um the the, the range can only just be uh, between um one and um, minus one. Let's just see what happens if we uh, if we do that. So let's save that and go back to our, our simulation. Oh, I've called it a simulation. That sounds grand. That's pretty good now, isn't it? That's a ball that's bouncing around and crashing into things. And you know, I wonder if we actually took off gravity now as well because in a sense we don't want the complication of gravity on our beastie so let's take that off i wonder what effect that has if we actually take gravity off now we should still get the bouncing around and we are uh, so there it is flying around in the box the invisible box and i think i think it's probably better that we take gravity off for, for what we want to do. We can always put it back on later if we want. All right. Well, that's that's good. I like that. We've got, um, we've basically got this little sphere, which is every 60th of a second, or whatever the frame rate is, it's uh, every frame, it's getting this random force on it and bouncing around, bouncing off the walls. I think that looks quite promising.